scores for Washington. 24 yards on that one. What's going on out there, you two? What's up, Team Hollywood? And what's up, my college football fans? It's your man, Hollywood Sports. What's good, everybody? What's good? If you are new to my channel, thank you for clicking on my video and welcome to Hollywood Sports. Guys, we are back on College Football 25 with my Washington Huskies dynasty. Guys, we just finished up our first season. As you can see on the screen, guys, we went 8-5, and 6-3 and three in the Big Ten Conference. I thought we had a fantastic first year. Um, we ended up in the top 25. We we got if you if you're me with the with our channel guys in our team, we were ranked ninth in the in the country. So we, we did okay, guys. We 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 rebuilding. You know, we went to the national title last year, and this is our first year. You know, but um, on our rebuild, guys. But we're gonna we we we're gonna make some noise in the, in this country, guys. We're gonna make some noise nationally. We're gonna make some noise. Uh, but let's go ahead and view. Our job offers. You know, I've never done this before, guys. But so let's go check it out. Let's see what we got going on here. I don't plan on leaving the state of Washington. It says uh, the coach carousel. You user offered. Um. So I guess I uh, or oh, uh, uh, Indiana is uh, Illinois. I'm sorry, is offering us a job. 81 overall team. It says offensive coordinator. Oh, we can become an offensive coordinator. New coach preferences. Uh, primary architect and strategist. Alumni, no. Um, off scheme spread. Defensive scheme, 3-4. Previous head coach was Glenn West. Master motivator, fired. He was fired. Glenn West was fired. Um, so, top candidates. D. Howell, E. Upton, A. Watson, uh, are the top head coach candidates so I guess they want me to be a offensive coordinator all right job offer job downgrade it is a downgrade because I was a head coach right all right then we get an offer from Penn State it's an 86 overall team um, so that's a better team man Penn State knit the Lions they want uh, they looking for an offensive coordinator man all right then we got Pitt Pittsburgh Panthers another great team man they want me to play defensive coordinator they offer me a defensive coordinator job and then Wisconsin also offered me a deep defensive uh, coordinator job um, any coach any any coach defense over the head coach okay um, so that's what they're offering me guys user offered all openings we don't need to look at that guys and uh, so we're gonna go back guys we're not going to accept any of those. Let's see if I did want to accept those. How would I do that? Oh, I would hit select. Okay, okay, I would hit select right there. Okay, but we're not doing it, so we're going back. We're staying at Washington, baby. We're going to build us a dynasty right here in Washington. All right, we don't need top stories. Um, it usually don't really tell us that much. We see Miami against Oregon. Um, Oregon beat us in that last game, and which put us out of the... 12 team college football playoffs now let's go to our early national signing day because we had a good recruiting class man a fantastic recruiting class we were number 12 we had the 12th best recruiting in the country all right um uh let's see uh he signed uh bruce lyle signed let me let me get out of the way this is our signing day guys these are the recruits we got Okay, let's start with uh, Spencer Tooney. Um, he's actually, he was one of the first guys that committed, guys. He's a quarterback, field general. Um, he's 6'5", 199. He's going to compete for the starting position. We got another quarterback that's going to compete for the starting position, Bruce Lyle. 6'201". Um, uh, okay, we got an athletic guy just signed, George Mastru. Um He's a scrambler, another quarterback, but he can play other positions. Uh, we definitely gonna have because uh, uh, you know our our our, our senior starter um, is gonna be going to the NFL if he gets drafted. Um, we got uh, Alani Ria. 
and he's a right tackle. We need some offensive linemen for sure. We have weak right tackle, so he may be able to compete for a starting position. Um, Mario Rasmussen, he's a right guard, another good offensive lineman, 6'5", 290. That's pretty big for a, a right guard, man. So we got some good recruits, guys. You see um, they're four and five star recruits. Here's our five star recruit right here. Okay, then we have Carlos Vela. Um, he's another big time four star recruit, man. Um, right outside linebacker. So guys, we, we got some good guys, man. Um, a free safety. We have Mr. Ori Agwebubu, whatever his name is, from Hawaii. Six foot 221, nice size for a free safety. Roman in the field, four star. We got another four star, Ben Jordan, wide receiver. Good stuff, guys. These guys are signing, man. Um, your boy Nolan Ojabo. Um, he's a vertical threat, tight end. Yes. Um, then we have Bill Woolyhan. Wo yeah, Woolyhan. Another free safety. Four star D tackle. 6'6", 3'70". Wow, we got some good recruits, guys. Um, my boy right here signed with Oregon. No biggie. Um, then we got Emilio Salas. He signed. 6'5", 215. Athletic guy. Um, we're going to figure out what we're going to have to do with him. Um, I don't know what position he plays, but he plays. He, he, he's, he probably can play on both sides of the football when they talk about athletic. Wow. So we'll figure that out. And then we got James Caps, another good size D tackle, 6'3, 298. Um, another four star. Uh, and then we got a five star wide receiver, George Kiki. Um, yeah, this guy, 6'3, 197. Um, I could go in and look at their ratings, guys, but that's unnecessary. Uh, we'll figure out every, we'll look at their ratings when it comes to. Um, put them in a depth chart whether I red shirt them or not um, and then we have another athletic guy um, Brian Carter another he's a three-star recruit so uh, yeah guys this is what we got going on right here now um, I, I hope I'm doing this right do I need to do something with these guys let me, let me click on them uh, okay I don't think we need to do anything I clicked on them ain't nothing happened um, so let's back. All right. If, if there's something I'm doing wrong, guys, let me know. Let me know. Um, so those are the guys we signed, guys. That's that's period. That's all. Those are the guys we signed on early National Day. Managed staff. All right. We're gonna leave everybody the same as far as I'm concerned. Um, Dat Murphy. Um, he is our head coach, offensive coordinator Jordan Spencer. Um, can we let's look at their talent tree? Um, we don't really have. I think we got ten points there. Uh, let's see. Can we improve anything on him? Three or four. Uh, purchase hold. Well, we don't have enough points, but okay, okay, okay. Hold up. Oh yeah, hold the purchase. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay, so let's go back here. Lock in quarterback. Quarterback starts fourth quarter hot. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Quarterback start. Oh yeah, we need that one. We need some quarterback to get hot. So let's go ahead and get that one. Beautiful. All right. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and get this one. Pay it forward. Running back. Bonus XP for running backs when running backs are drafted in the top three rounds. Hmm. Let's go ahead and do that. We we can get all we can get, guys. We are gonna get all we can get. Uh, we don't have anything else, do we? Nope, we got zero. Okay, yeah, we put them all on him. I don't, we can't, we should have spread it out. Okay, but that's okay, that's okay, that's okay. We put it on the head coach, it's all good. 
and then Rob Miner is our defensive coordinator. Uh, cool. One year remaining on their on their on our head coach got five years remaining on his contract. All right, we managed the staff. Let's see staff moves. That's all the staff moves. All these guys got fired. <laughs> all these guys got fired. Wow. Eastern Michigan offensive coordinator, head coach from Eastern Michigan got fired. Both of man, Vanderbilt fired their defensive coordinator. Wow. You got a lot of people looking for jobs right now. Arizona State fired their defensive coordinator. Wow. <laughs> uh, let's see Carolina uh, let's see yep C Carolina what's the C means anyway they, they uh, he retired their defensive coordinator retired Pittsburgh their head coach got fired man a lot of people got fired Wow uh, let's see what their record was. Illinois, their uh, head coach got fired. Let's see. they He was on a hot seat. Offensive spread, 3-4. Their record with Illinois, 1-11. Career record, 1-11. So he that's why he got fired. Wow. <laughs> wow. Woo, boy. That's a lot of firings. All right. Let's go and advance the week. going to go ahead and advance um, okay. all right guys we got a bad week to start view job offers top stories manage staff same thing um, let's look at let's look at our team schedule and see if it's changed already all right guys our first game against FCF Northwest Hmm. No, this show this is what we did already. It says Yeah, we lost that first game 28 to 20. Hold on, let me go let's go back guys. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. Am I missing something here? Bad week. I don't get it. I do not get it. College football top 25. Let's go to the playoff bracket and see if they played any more games yet. Oh, I got it now, guys. I got it now. Because we're not in. So those are the playoff games right there. Okay, West Virginia beat Liberty. Um, Boston, I mean, Ohio State, they beat Clemson. Wow. Hmm. And then uh, Miami, Oregon beat Miami, and Notre Dame beat Oklahoma State. So that's the next round, the quarterfinals, man. West Virginia going up against Boston College, Ohio State, Alabama. Good games right there. Oregon, USC, Notre Dame, Utah. It would have been tough in this playoffs race, man. So let's go back, guys. Let's go ahead and advance. Let's go ahead and advance. Now I see what's going on. It's the same schedule because we haven't actually got to the next to the next uh, season yet because they're still in the college football playoffs so let's go ahead let's see what let's see where it's at right now let's look at the bracket again Woo wow so now we're in the semifinals Boston against Alabama and Oregon is going up against Utah Woo. Those are the final fours right there, man. Wow, Alabama's right there, number one seed, man. Let's get it. Let's go ahead and advance it again. Let's see who won this baby. Who's going to the national championship? There we go, guys. 
Oregon is going up against Alabama for the national championship. Let's advance. Let's see who won this, baby. Uh-oh. They were showing it, but let's go to the bracket. Oregon is the national champions, man. Oregon has won the national college football championship. They national champions, man. They beat number one Alabama 24 to 9. Wow. So wow, Oregon went through with some big good teams right there. Let's go back. Let's advance the week. Players leaving. Guys, I don't want to make this video too long. I'll do this on the next video, and then we'll just run into the next season, and we'll talk about our new schedule and everything like that. I'm Hollywood Sports. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on my next video.